bad. But I don't think I can manage much more than this. I guess I should just be grateful I was able to pass the beginner examination at all. Better do some studying. It sounds like this is going to be a busy week, what with that ominous practical exam looming over us. Hmm. I do have that radio from George here. We had that horrible radio back home, too. Never knew they made them this small, though. Let's see... Which station is Radio Trista? Ah, there we go. It's 9pm and you're listening to Radio Trista. Welcome, welcome. Don't touch that dial, listeners. You found the right place to be tonight. It's time for the start of a brand new program here on Radio Trista, coming at you promptly every Sunday. I call it Aben Time, after the word for evening. Might be a little cliched, but sometimes simple is best, right? Cliches are cliches for a reason, after all. Anyway, my name is Misty, and I'll be your host. Hopefully I'll get to feature some famous guests at some point, so be sure you tune in every week or you might miss them. You know, she's got a pretty nice voice. This might be good to leave on in the background while I'm working. I hope life has been treating all of you well this month as we slowly near the end of April. Here in Trista, the beautiful Lino flowers have passed their peak and begun to wilt. But wilting flowers are beautiful in their own way as they serve to remind us just how fleeting this existence truly is. I'm sure many of our listeners are students, busy with the challenges of adjusting to their new lives. But what harm is there in taking a moment to admire nature every now and again? It's good for what ails you, I say. Okay, let's get your practical exam started, shall we? To be completely clear from the outset, this exam is about more than just testing your physical strength and stamina. It's designed to hone in on how capable you are of making strategic combat decisions on the fly. Defeating your opponent quickly is a good thing, certainly, but it won't be enough to score you high marks here. Huh, interesting. So we're going to have to use our heads for this one, huh? <laughs> You'll see. Anyway, let's get this month's exam started, shall we? Reen, Elliot, Gaius, you're up first. Please step forward. Right. Uh-oh. Got it. sensing any life coming from it at all. That's right. Think of it like a scarecrow. Only it's a moving scarecrow, I guess. Either way, it's not alive. I've set its parameters fairly high, though, so it is formidable. But if you give it your all, I'm confident you can beat it. Probably. 
Make good use of your Arcus's combat link abilities, for example, and I bet it'll be a piece of cake! Hint, hint. Oh, <sighs> So that's what you're playing at. My turn. My turn. Right. Ah. Is everybody okay? One. D don't know how, though. Not bad. Not bad at all. Excellent use of combat links, too. 
Seems like the practice you got in the old schoolhouse really paid off. <laughs> it just may have. Oh? Have those three been training in secret? All right, on to the second group. Laura, Emma, Eusis. Come forward. I thought it would be. It does seem like combat links are the key to fighting it effectively, though. That's rather unfortunate. 